Let us hope he will answer. Hello? Okay, we have some. Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I hear you, my friend. You are live on air. Do you, are you listening to us on YouTube? Do you know the topic? Yeah, 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 I know the topic, but I actually called to ask about uh, a question about yesterday's topic, if that's okay. Question about what? Yesterday's topic. No problem, go ahead. <clears throat> okay, so it's about because I actually saw the whole thing yesterday, so I don't know about this topic. So I'm asking about uh, the first five minutes. Uh, which is uh, if you know what I'm talking about mm -hmm. okay so I would like to understand because uh, I did my research mm -hmm. you said in the explanation that if the Quran is preserved then why the word deep does not exist in the Arabic mm -hmm. uh, verse so this is what you said exactly uh, and I'm quoting you, by the way. So I actually went to Arabic dictionary. And, and the I word said, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And I said, if the Muslims they say that the word laji mean deep, correct? Mm -hmm. I said that too, right? Yeah. If they, if they say the word laji. Yeah, you said for the deep. sake of the argument. You said for the sake of the argument. No, no, no. no I said in one of the meaning. Go. My video is there. If they say one of the meaning is laji, the video is still there. Is deep. Yeah, I know. No, okay. you said okay. this so, for, okay. for the sake so, of the so argument. So when you quote me, yeah. quote everything. Don't quote just only what you like. Go ahead. Yeah, you said, but you interrupted me. I was right. actually gonna say you said also for the sake of the argument. No, no. So I went no, to no, the no, Arabic no, no, no. dictionary. I, for one the sake of, the of meaning, argument, I said one of the meaning. I said one of the meaning mm -hmm. is. So is is one of the meaning is. Go ahead. Yeah. So one of the meaning of the Arabic dictionary for leji is deep. So it actually can be. Deep for the word laji. That's is, what I said. If you said for the sake of the argument, if we, even if we say the word laji is for deep, we have another issue. So the, the word and deep if they can say be in the, for the, in the word dictionary. Legi. In the dictionary. Okay, let's go. You see, first of all, have you ever seen a sea is not deep? Mm -hmm. What? Have you ever seen a sea is not deep? What do you mean? I'm talking about the verse. I'm talking about the verse too. It says bahar. Bahar means yeah, sea. Yeah. Okay, have you ever need? Do you need to say deep sea when the, the sea is deep anyway? Does it say? Sir, we are not does, talking does it, about the obvious. No, 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 no. We are talking you about. Ask, no, hold on, hold on. It says Bahar, Bahrain, which means a crazy, mm -hmm. wavy sea. Otherwise, if you are saying that this, it, it doesn't mean wavy. No, only. my friend, it means my friend, deep too. My, my friend, no. If you if you say if you say that. Okay, let's read the mm -hmm. verse. Is it, does the verse describe a storm or no? No, it doesn't describe a storm. Let us see what. Okay, what translation you are reading from? I'm reading from the uh, Mufti Taqi. Okay, I will go there. Let me see. Let me find it so we can be reading the same Mufti. Uh, look like they don't have it here. Mududi Mufti. Can we? Uh, we can just read the verse in Arabic if you want. No problem. You don't know Arabic. I heard you. This is not Arabic. No, no I am an Arabic speaker. Okay, read it for I'm an us. Arabic That's wonderful. Read it for us. Go ahead. Okay. Aukab al Mati Bahran Laji Laji Yaksha Yaksha Mojim and Fauke Mojim and Fauke the Hab. Okay. Stop here. Stop. 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 It is a reference for the darkness of the sea. We are starting no, 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 from no, no, the no, origin. No, no, no. The darkness. Translate we are the going up. My friend, translate the word as it is. Maujon min fauke. Maujon min fauke. Translate. What does that mean? Wave on top of which wave on top of which hmm. clouds. Then layer okay. of darkness. So wave in the one top. on top of okay. each other. How 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 the wa wa waves of the ocean come? Wave uh, in the top of that wave. Wave in the top of the other wave. Wave in the top of the other wave. In the top of it, there is a cloud. And what kind of a cloud? It's a very mm -hmm. dark cloud. Correct? The darkness is for the cloud and the sea. Okay, the, hold on. The word no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let us be honest. Does it say wave over wave over wave over wave and then in the top of it there is dark 
cloud. Dark cloud? It doesn't say dark cloud. It says, it says cloud layers of darkness. La layers of darkness is a reference for the sea. Uh, no, then no, 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 the word zulumat is coming after the word sea or after the word cloud? Both. It's coming uh, no, don't tell me both. Don't tell me, no, don't, don't tell me both, my friend. It's in the in the sentence. Does it come look, after the look. word after the word sahab or after the word bahar? Where is the word zulamat appear? After after the word bahar and after the word sahab. No, is no, the you are not being honest. Bahar. Okay, not okay. Hold on. Let us say that you look are, at the verse. Don't oh, look at me. Hold look on, at hold the on. verse. People will, people will laugh with us in two in, in, in two minutes. It's, so you are saying mm -hmm. that the cloud is dark and the sea is dark, right? I'm not saying the uh, cloud is dark. I'm saying cloud, then layers of darkness, one on top of each other. But, but you, as a reference for the sea, the uh, darkness of the sea. No, but a second, a second ago, people heard you saying the word darkness is for both. Now you take it back. No, 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 no. You misunderstood me. You misunderstood me. You oh. are the one that says for both. I said... Volumat comes for after the word Bahar and it comes after the word Sahab, not as a reference. Okay, so for how it. you know it says so layers how, of darkness okay, as so, a reference so, for okay, the Bahar. Okay, let us go. I will go with you. Where in the verse it says that the word Dulamat is about the Bahar, which means the sea, not about the cloud. Where it says that? I, I mean, how, okay, go easy, ahead. Mm. Easy. Okay, the, in the Arabic, mm. the Sahab, then on top of it, there, there is the word G. G, uh, G, uh, mm. G, G in Arabic, okay. which means stop. And then volumat, mm. volumat, if you go to the English translation, layers of darkness, one on top of each other. Mm. This is talking about the reference of the first sentence, mm. layers of darkness on, on the sea, one on top of each other. Okay, it exactly on. says right, that. Right. Now, if you let's want, listen, let, listen, me, listen. let me complete, let me complete. Let, 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 no, Just let me make my stop point. Stop with the word Sahab. You said there's letter G in the top. You said, what does that mean? The, the letter G? It says, G means that we stop layers of darkness. This the, is the reference what, for I, the first I, I, one, I, I, Bahar, and I, I, then go on top of you. each other. I don't hear you very well. What G mean? Repeat again, slowly. G means that we stop. We stop. Then we continue read, yeah? Okay, we, guys, me and G, we stop. First, the Quran was not exist with this G. This is something you added to it. In the, in the same Have you time, read the Tilawa? The Have you read the Tilawa? In the, the same time, the in the same time, let us, say, let us say stop. You said we stop. You are the one who said the word stop, correct? Yeah, yeah, okay. I agree. So he continues saying darkness in the top of darkness. And then you will see. It says, Zulumat mm ba'diha -hmm. ba'diha. Listen, mm -hmm. does it go for Sahab or for the Mauj? Which one of them is the because it has, goes for the Mauj? It goes for the Mauj. How you know? Hold on. I said it three times. You are the one who said you stop. And the word before Dulumat yeah. is the word Sahab, which means a cloud, correct? Yeah. Okay. So stop. the word so the, the so word the, the word darkness come right after the word cloud, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, so how not you... right after after the, after the stop. It's a reference for the bahar. Doesn't the matter. Doesn't matter. So now he, so now he is describing what I mean. I say to you, there's wave after wave after wave, and there is a cloud and dark darkness over darkness. And here it says mm -hmm. that the last word. You agree with me that the last word is cloud, and then the word darkness mm -hmm. come after the cloud. So the darkness describe what Comes you say. Layers you say, of darkness. Hold on. We are talking the yeah, layers. So if I say red car, if I say the word car in Arabic, we say that it's like the, the the word they are different from English. So we say sayyara mm -hmm. hamra, correct? So the mm -hmm. word the word sayyara mean a car, and then we the word red come after it. In English, is different. You say that the, the, okay. the color first, and then you say. You are describing what? So you said red car. So in Arabic it says car red. So here it says Sahab dark, cloud dark. So how in the world you come to the conclusion that this is about the wave and what the connection between the cloud and you said this is not about the stormy weather. Why he is talking about the cloud if he is talking about the deep sea? What the connection between the cloud and the deep sea? 
Okay, sir, I listened to you. I did not interrupt you. Let me make my point, and I will listen to you making your point. Go ahead. Good. So, we have layers of darkness covered going one on top of the other. This mm. is the first sentence. Then mm. comes cloud stuff. Then comes layers of darkness, one on top of each other. Mm. This is a reference of the sea. It can also be the cloud. It can also be the cloud, but it's not a reference for the cloud. It is a reference for the Bahar because it is describing one on top of each other. Then it says these darkness are, are t- layers on top of each other. This is the translation English, not me speaking subjectively. Hmm. Then the second reference for my claim is the last uh, statement of this verse. وَمَنْ لَمْ يَجْعَلَ اللَّهُ لَهُ نُورُ فَمَا لَهُ مِنْ نُورُ Which means that the, uh, and whom God did not make light has okay. no light. All right. Which means that this is a reference for the first one. Mm-hmm. We have no light in the darkness of the sea. We are going up. Sahab, stop. Layers of darkness describing the beginning of the sentence of the Bahar. And this is perfectly normal. There is no contradiction here. So okay. I will let you speak. All right. So guys, this is what our friend he present to us. But look what he just did. He just confirmed what I said because the, 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 the Quran speak about the darkness, this darkness, and he connect the word cloud with it. If I am a person speak about science, all of us we knew that even if the sun is there and there's no cloud at all, and even if you live in the Sahara Desert, and if you go deep in the water, thousands of, 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 of feet, there's total darkness. So the word Sahab have nothing to do, which means cloud. Cloud have no effect in the deep sea. So either you have to say that Allah mistakenly, he mentioned the word cloud, because it have nothing to do with the deep sea, or you have to say Allah, he mentioned it because it affect the darkness. So if you are saying it's affect the darkness, obviously this is not in the sea. This is on the top of the sea. That's why it says, so if he take his hand, he cannot see it. Why? Because it's dark. There's dark, dark storm. Have you ever heard of a dark storm where you cannot even see your hand? Like if you live in the desert, you will see even sand storm, what they do. So it's so dark because the cloud will make the sun disappear. This is why it says, مِنْ فَوْقِهِ سَحَابُ ظُلُمَاتٌ بَعْضُهَا فَوْقُ بَعْضٍ So, بَعْضُهَا, as a, as a fame word, go to what? To sah- as, as, as the Sahab. The Sahab is the female, not the Mawj. So, if we want to say the Mawj, we will say, well, the Mawj, ظُلُمَاتَهُ, uh, correct? You speak Arabic. I believe maybe you, 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 mm-hmm. you do good. So, ظُلُمَاتُ الْمَوْج or سحاب ظلمات بعضها not بعضه بعضها فوق بعض so obviously here is speaking about the cloud in the top because there's no connection first with the deep ocean sea and the darkness of you know of the cloud because there's a cloud or not still is going to be deep dark you cannot see anything and here you will see if he left his hand why the human being he live inside inside the sea do the human being. God here is speaking about a human being. Do a human being. He's a fish. He's a whale who go dive in the sea. No. So the one who is the one who will stretch his hand, it's a human, if a man. The man usually, my friend, he don't live in the sea, as I know. He live, he can live in the top of the sea in a, in a, in a boat. He can live in the, in the, in the land. But we never saw a, a, like a person who go down in the sea and he stay there forever. So if a man, he stretch out his hand, he hardly can see it. You do not need to stretch it, my friend, to see your hand. But because it's so dark, which means there's no light, it's totally isolated. Even if you stretch your hand as a human, not as a fish. So what the connection between the cloud and the deep sea? Go ahead. Okay. <clears throat> so, first of all, I believe that, uh, let us assume that you have uh, read the Quran. Let mm-hmm. us assume that. Mm-hmm. So, the Quran, by the way, I'm speaking, you speaking, you might agree, you might disagree. People no will judge, of course. No problem, sure. No problem. So, the Quran, when you read it, it has a language in a way that it goes speaking. Then go backward in the sentence, explaining it, then go forward without contradiction just explaining the second sentence and moving on forward backward forward backward like that 
this is the language of speaking of the Quran. If you do speak Arabic and read the Quran, okay. like some chapters, you would understand what I'm talking about. So this is what we know when we read the Quran. It has this language of going backward and forth, back and forth in, in describing the first uh, adjective of the sentence and what refers to us. Hmm. Now I told you that G on top of the Sahab is a stop. Okay. Now if you if you say volumat alone, I agree with you. But it says volumat in ba'buha fawqa ba'd. Ba'buha fawqa ba'd explaining the mawj min fawqihi mawj of the first one. It is explaining the darkness of the sea which says explicitly mawj min fawqihi mawj. And the second one after the stop of the sahab, it says volumat ba'buha fawqa ba'd. So it is explaining the darkness of the wave as we go down. But we are beginning in the sentence as we are going up. This is perfectly normal as an Arabic speaker. Hmm. And this confirms with the last one saying, Woman Limaj Allahu Nur, from Allahum Nur. Okay. And God that has not made light for those who don't believe, the disbelievers, he has no light. It right. explains the first sentence no. while it was at the last. So this is the language speaking of the Quran. All right. But now, you see, let me make one, but, one but, more. But, point. but you see, but just one, one, let me, one, let me make, one point. Just one, one, just one point. Just one point. You see the word Badaha? I did not interrupt you. Just let me say this. No, no, I want you to explain it. I'm, I'm not going to talk. I just, do you see the word Badaha? The Badaha, how the word Badaha goes back to the Moj? Yeah, yeah. It how? goes to the Moj. How, how? That's what I said. How? Is Badaha fit with the word Moj? Do we say ba Moj? Badaha for, uh, for ba Badaha? Okay. Moj, <laughs> in okay. the translation, in the translation, uh -huh. in the translation, uh -huh. waves on top of each other. Uh -huh. Then after the G, even the listeners can distinguish the similarity between them. You're not listening. You're not listening. In the correct Arabic language, do we say Moj Ba'daha or Ba'duhu? If the word Badaha goes what do you back, mean? I didn't get it. What do you mean? If we want to say this Moj, the word Moj, you see in Arabic we have a female word, we have a male word, we have word with which male and female, mm -hmm. etc. So if I want to say Moj, there's Moj mm -hmm. and there's Moja, correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, what Moja? What is yeah. the difference between Moj and Moja? I don't know. For me, there is no difference. Moj, Moja. No, why you add T at the end? What what this T? T A, you mean A. Hamzi Marfua. What Hamzi? What what uh, Moja? Moja with the with Haraka. Yeah. Hamzi on top. Moja, Moja, okay. Moja, Moja, Moja. So if I say okay, let's say I wanna say uh uh قط, I say قطة. What is the difference between qit mm -hmm. and qitta? Male and female. Okay, so what the difference is? Male and female. Okay, so when we add in that, this word, when we add that letter at the end, we make it female. So is the word mawj here is a female word or male word? I don't get it. What, what do you mean, male and female? Wave. We are talking if about the wave. Badaha, the badaha, the of, uh, of do the badaha, do badaha go to a male word? Badaha, badaha. Yeah. It is explaining motion of folkhi mouch. Okay, but that's what I'm saying. Do it the word, do the word, the layer. do the word, I'm about the layer. is the word mouch. What layer, what, what, what is the word layer? It says, you see, it says, Badu, even for both, it says mouch, I mean, folkhi mouch. How that explaining mm -hmm. that? So, listen carefully. Baduha is about each other, right? In the top of each other, correct? They are like coming. All right. But here it's coming Black to describe layer. to describe to describe a female word, not a male. And the word mawj is not a is not a female word. Same time, you just you did not. <laughs> you, you, this is. <laughs> You did not answer anything. You did not this answer anything. This is not the explanation. No, you see, this is your explanation. No problem. You see, I will go with you. After, by the way. after the no, 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 my, my friend, my, my friend, my, my friend, my friend, layer. my friend, In my the friend. first one, there is layer. My friend, I, actually, your, your your call for me. I want to say thank you first for calling me. Honestly, you made my day because look what happened. Allah, according to you, He knew about the deep sea, correct? Okay. Yeah. All right. 
if we go two verses after, we will see Allah, he claimed that there is hail which is coming from mountains in the sky. So Allah the coming scientist, from, from where? From the sky, you speak Arabic. I do not need to translate for you. The verse in the front of you, go ahead and read it. Okay, can you give me the reference? Where is, where is the reference? Two verses after, verse number 43. The same chapter, we are not jumping anywhere. We are talking about Allah who knows nature. Thank you very much for calling me. So if Allah, he knew what is inside the deep sea, there is no way he do not know what is inside the deep sky. Have you ever heard of a God? Mm -hmm. He believed that there is mountains of hail and this is where he break hail from it and he sent it down to earth. Yes, where is the verse? I just I'm just trying to see where you are quoting exactly. This friend, is the first time that I'm hearing. Verse number saying. three. Verse number, sorry, 43. Just two verses after. 43? Yeah, three. Wait, wait a minute, let me open it. Hmm. The verse we are talking about, we were talking about is number 40. If you go verse number 41, then verse number 42, then verse number 43, you will find the verse which is funny. So Allah is scientist. Allah, he knew according to you what is inside the deep sea. Christian Prince, he got it wrong mm -hmm. according to you. Can you accept that Allah, which I did not, Allah is an ignorant? How does God, he knew what is inside the deep sea? That it's very we're talking dark. about the deep sea. The deep sea, you just, you just said. Listen, listen, listen. No, 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 no. Listen, so listen, now listen, you're bringing let us, another, let us another, not another go, verse. Let us not to go, to not to go back, for, backward, forward, talking over each other and mean, mean nothing. You, you made your statement. I made my statement about the deep sea and people will laugh. Now, exactly. If Allah, let us if not Allah, talk about another verse. No, 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 wait, wait. Don't I know what you mean by the second Don't verse. run away because if Allah, he knew the deep sea, he should not. run away. Okay. So, okay. Read the verse. What kind of God he do not know where the hell is coming from? I'm trying to open the verse, sir. All right. I thought the verse in front of you, you are reading for me the same chapter. Why you need to open it? No, I'm not reading the whole Quran in front of me. I'm just preparing this question and going. Ah, I'm discussing this question, okay, not okay, the okay, my friend, question. My friend, it takes two seconds to open it. Search in you know, Google, Prophet Google, Quran 24, verse number 43. Why is it going to take forever? Quran. 24 verse 43 okay mm. look like you do not know what we know that i'm about. living in a middle eastern country sir so the internet might not, it might not be as your internet was so fine talking to me until time. now yeah now it's uh, slow to open a verse just give me some time just give, okay no. yes, yeah, right. this one mm -hmm. yeah exactly okay so what is your claim now i'm reading it my friend you said you were watching my video yesterday and I mentioned that right away when I yeah, mentioned yeah. that. So how come you did not hear it? So I do not explain it. It says here that وَيُنِزِّلُ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ مِنْ جِبَالٍ فِيهَا مِنْ بَرَدٍ فَيُصِيبُ بِهِ مَنْ يَشَاءُ Translate. I'm listening. Mm -hmm. You speak Arabic. You speak English. I am the one who do not know. You are the one who teach me. I'm listening. Go ahead. Okay. So it is uh, verse 43. So do you not realize that Allah drives the clouds, mm. then joins them together, then turns them into a sheep, mm. uh, into a heap, sorry. Mm. Then you see the rain coming out from their midst. Mm. He sends down from the sky mountains uh, of clouds having hail in them. What, 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 what mountain in the cloud? Read Arabic, read Arabic and translate. Are you reading the first translation? Are you, are, are you fooling me now? I'm reading the Mufti, Taki, Usmani you, you, your translation. Mufti, your Mufti is a big fat liar. You speak Arabic, you do not need a translation. You translate. <laughs> read for me the Arabic. Oh my God. A second ago, you were you want to teach me Arabic, Do right? you want me to read it in Arabic yes. or English? Yes, read it in Arabic and translate. You translate, don't use Mufti. The Mufti is a shish kebab, is a hummus, and you have to agree. He's lying. There's no way it says here. <laughs> well, you know, yes, you will get this him. Is your thing, you yeah. will get him. You, you will get him busted yourself. You, you yourself, you will do it. Go read the verse and translate for me. No one can determine that. Uh, this is subjective. My this friend, is subjective. No, not subjective. Anyway, no, no. Because, 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 Allah, because, because, because when you add, when now. you add words like 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 a cloud, you are lying. Do you agree? Mm -hmm. if, if there's a word the cloud there. What word? Well, you know, mean a summer when the translator he added the word like a cloud. It is a lie because it says, Well, you know, mean a summer in in Jibel in Fiha. Where is the word the cloud? I'm telling 
انا ترى ان الله يسجي سحابا ثم يولف بينه أوكي. ثم يجعله ركانا فترى الوقت يخرج من خلال وينزل من جمال من السماء من جبال فيها من البر يصيب من ي... به من يشاء ويصف عن من يشاء يكاد السنه برقه يذهب بالابصار اي دونت سي اني سحاب هي اكزاكتلي سو واي واي يور مفتي سين ذا وورد لايك ا كلاود like mountains where he, where is getting this from <laughs> so now i'm asking you does it say I'm in the... the cloud means mountain i'm saying the cloud means means mountain my friend yes i'm saying that yeah you're from the translation you were reading no 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 my, no. my friend friend my friend the translation no, 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 okay no, no. does it no, say no, no. i'm my, just reading my, my this friend, to you there's no there is no don't cloud waste, don't no waste cloud. my time does it say that allah he sent down from the sky from mountain in the sky hail does it say that Yes, it says that. Okay. Yes, it says. So guys, we, uh, our friend here agreed, thank, thank you for being honest, that Allah claimed that there is mountains of hail and Allah, he sent hail from those mountains in the sky. So how in the world mm -hmm. Allah, he knew the deep sea, but he do not know how hail is made. How such a mistake. What do you mean he does not know how hail is made? It's we a, just I just proved to you I just proved to you through the language of the Quran the first the first verse of the deep of the ocean now we are going to a second one to prove no relation between the first one my friend my friend do you prove to me nothing you, you just agree that Allah he said that Allah he sent hell from mountains in the sky correct this wasn't the question we are talking about the deep sea ah, and you, so you Allah, just changed so, the subject okay. without so any according consent. to you according to you allah is a smart in the deep sea he is dumb in the hail that's what you are saying so yeah. here so, yeah. you, are, listen you, to so me. you are listen saying to me. okay hold on hold on you see i told you, you i you told me you told me that you are calling to talk about this topic right and this is the topic allah he knew what is inside the sea and allah he knew what is inside the sky so how allah he knew if allah he knew what is inside the side you, you try to defend the stupid verse in the quran that allah he is speaking about the deep sea and then the second we ask you how allah he believed for a second that there's mountains of hail how you can explain mm -hmm. the stupidity here have you ever heard of a God? He says such a stupid thing. It doesn't say. It doesn't say that God doesn't know. Don't lie. It doesn't say that God doesn't know. No, it doesn't say that. It says He knows. It says one. He knows. It says He knows. He knows where the hail coming from. I'm asking you: Is hail coming from mountains in the sky? It, it is coming from the cloud. Yeah, yeah. No, not uh, from the, the cloud. Don't lie. Says. You are the one who translate. You are the one who said yes. It says from mountains in heaven. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's wrong so, with that? So where is hail coming from? From mountains in heaven. And you are saying to me, what's wrong with that? So you believe as a Muslim that there is hail of mountains in heaven and Allah, he sent hail from it. Okay. So let me, so let me, so let me explain to you. Alam tara anna Allah yijji sahaban. It means that Allah, mm. uh, so I know it's only in Arabic. So let me put that in the mm. translator so that I can paraphrase it for the listener. You will have been to my you have been. I don't know what that means in English. He composed it. You will have been. You know, he, he collected together. He put it together. OK. And no, 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 I didn't put it together. I didn't put it. Uh, I'm just no, knowing no, the word in you, Arabic. I'm, I'm, not how to mean, you, I'm telling English. you what the word means. You, you, said, you, it, you said you do not know what the word means. I just continue. told you what the word means. OK, so I'm asking you now. When Allah He says, and Allah He send from the mountains, and you agree, from mountains in heaven, He sent hail down. Mm -hmm. Is that an accurate statement, yeah. or it's a stupid statement? Do we have do we have mountains of hail in heaven, flying in heaven? <coughs> I'm trying to open the verse. When you in the sky, in the jibal, there where is it yeah hmm. so here the mountains here about is in the context is hmm. cloud in the second okay, one okay, it, it, on. it, it, no, 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 no. okay hold on hold on hold on hold on the you see, replacement of the second one you see let, let me get you busted shall i show you the interpretation for the verse do the muslim interpret the verse are you a, are you a scholar in islam I'm, are you a scholar 
No, no, I'm not a scholar. Okay. I'm not a scholar. So, I might be wrong, by the way. Okay. okay. There might be better translation. Oh, okay. There might be okay. better interpretation no, than no. mine. This is a tra this is a interpretation. This is your scholar saying that there is mountains in heaven, and Allah He sent healer from it. And I can show it to you in Arabic. I can mm -hmm. show it to you in English. Like as an example, this is a Jalalain. This is who a Jalalain. This is not me. It says here, mm -hmm. and He sent down from heaven, from the heaven, out of mountains. Do you see it? There's mountains in heaven. Yeah, but the mountains, but the mountains, but the mountains, hmm. but the mountains. Hmm. Here, it is in the reference of the clouds. Let us let us this get let, let, let us let us get you busted. The let, us, let, us get let us get you busted. Let us let us let us let us get you busted. This is Al Baghawi and this is Ibn Abbas describing and telling us what happened. Read for me. I will put it in the front of you. وينزل من السماء من جبال فيها من برد يعني ينزل البرد من صلا وقيل معناه وينزل من السماء من جبال أي مقدار جبال في الكثرة من البرد and then he continues mm -hmm. saying and they say وينزل من السماء جبال من برد but this is not what the verse saying the first saying ينزل من السماء من جبال فيها وقيل معناه وينزل من جبال في السماء تلك الجبال من برد عن ابن عباس رضي الله عنه. The برد the برد the جبال it is in the meaning of the context of the something which is big. So he brings from the sky. My friend, my friend, it's a clear. The جبال. Okay, I want you to translate. Translate. Okay, okay, listen, listen. As big as the mountain. Okay, let us let us translate. You translate to me. I I will I will read the word. You just, you, just, you just told me my, I don't like translators. You my, just told me I don't like translators. He's a no, I want, you, I like want your translation. I want your translation. Translate. Yeah, um, I just I just explained two times. If you want to tell some of no, no, can you translate? So, can, 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 you, you, no, no, no. can you translate, can you my friend? Don't not? waste my time. Can you translate what Abdul Abbas said, please? This is Ibn Abbas. This is not me. I don't care your... about the Abbas. I'm, here. I'm giving why, you the, the, the dictionary. I'm it... giving you the Arab dictionary. Oh, so Ibn Abbas is a stupid person. He do not know what he's talking about. No, 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 no. I said I will give it from the dictionary. This is my style and explaining. My friend, what dictionary? Now you want to go? What dictionary? What dictionary? Style. It says in Arabic, and he sent down from the sky from mountains in it hail. And you agreed. The hail of mountains of hail, mountains here in the Arabic. It doesn't say mountains of hail. It doesn't say. It doesn't say. Listen, listen. listen first, it doesn't say mountains of hail. That's funny. It says min jibalin fiha min baradin. So he sent it from where? From mountains. What he sent from those mm -hmm. mountains? Barad, which means hail. Correct. No, 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 no. It says <laughs> min jibal fiha min barad. Okay. It means okay. jibal min fiha min min barad. Okay. 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 Why you don't want? Why, why you don't want? Why you don't want to translate? Why you don't want to translate? What, why you don't want to translate? What, why you don't want to translate what Ibn Abbas is saying? Is that the problem? No, I'm giving you the translation from the dictionary. What you what dictionary, is in the context what dictionary, of the What dictionary? Side. We are reading the interpretation. Tell me what Ibn Abbas said, please. He said. I don't know, you tell me. Huh? I don't know, you tell me. Well, you know I translate. You are good in Arabic, you are good in English. It says here, Inna fissamai jibalin min barad. Translate to the people. Min jibal, min jibal. No, 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 there's no jibal, min jibal. Don't lie, read it in front of you. Inna fissamai jibal. It's in from, yunazil min assamai min jibal, min jibal. Hold on, read, read. Why you don't read, why you don't read? What's the problem? Why suddenly you don't know Arabic now? I'm reading. Okay. Okay. No, read for me. Read it. Okay, uh, guys, we use the mean 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 jibal in fi sama. No, no, no. In the mean sama mean jibal. It's the other way around. My friend, read it. Are you blind? I'm reading it. I read it. It's I just read it. Okay, it says here why you need to. Should I use Google Translation and get you busted? No, 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 use the Arabic dictionary. <laughs> so, what dictionary? What's wrong with you? Read the words one by one. It says here, in inna fi samai jibalin min barad. Translate, what does that mean? Min jibalin, min jibalin. Okay, where is the word, where is the word min? 
Let me zoom more. It's in front of me. Okay, hold on. It's in front of me too here. It says, where, where is main, my friend? You're talking about the verse, right? I'm talking here about the interpretation. It says, yeah. in samai jibali min barad. What does that mean? Translate. Min jibali. Min jibali don't, piha don't, min be, don't be a child. Can you translate the sentence of Ibn Abbas? Yes or no? I just did three times. You don't want to not No, you did not. If you ask me for the first time, I will be Inna fi samai jibali min barad. A sen small sentence. Translate. Inna fi samai jibali min barad. What? Translate. Go ahead. This is not. This is not what the verse. You are just quoting this correctly. You need to say min samai min jibali min barad. My, my friend. It's in front okay. of me. I'm reading. Well, you need to say min Thank you. He is sending from the sky. Okay. What is in the sky? From mountains in it. Correct. From mountains, fiha mm min -hmm. Okay, so what's in the mountains? Yes. It is the context of the sky. It is what? the jibal. There's, it is something for big in the Arabic There's mountains. It is in, not the literal water there is of the mount, mountain. There is mountains in the sky, and he sent hail from those mountains. Correct? No, no, no. This is your translation. Okay, your no, translation. this is not my translation. Here we go. Let me get you busted again. This is Ajalalain. And everybody is laughing at you now. All my talk is Arabic dictionary. I'm talking from the Arabic dictionary. Don't, what, this, what Arabic dictionary? This is the Quran. Are you reading the word by itself? Listen, he sent down from the heaven out of mountains. Do you see it? This is your Muslim. This is the official government shall, website. Shall of the we read the Bible by itself without Jesus? Uh, listen, then listen, listen. You see, now you the are the Bible. Suddenly now, you do, out. suddenly now you do not know literally. Arabic. Suddenly now you are more smart than the one who do interpretation. So when you want the interpretation, is good for you. When you don't want the you, you dump them in the garbage. Why I'm reading the interpretation of Ibn Kathir. Why Ibn Kathir? Why Ibn Kathir. Okay. I'm reading Ibn Kathir. Okay, you want to read Ibn Kathir? Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, guys, uh, this guy, he want to read Ibn Kathir for us. Are you sure? I'm reading Ibn Kathir the whole time. You're the one who is not listening. Okay, let, let me ask you. Do you accept Ibn Kathir to be a smart person to explain the Quran? Yes or no? <laughs> Oh my God! What a strategy! What yes a or strategy. no? Yes or no? Please, yes or no? I don't want to answer this question. I'm t I'm answering this. No, no, question. no! You are quoting don't for me, Ibn Kathir, for what reason? The bush Listen, and go okay. On other questions. Uh, this is Ibn Kathir. Let me get you busted. You are a liar and you are a fraud. Here we go. This is the verse in front of you, and this is Ibn Kathir in English. You thought you thought we do not have Ibn Kathir in English. This is in front of you. It says he means. That there are mountains yes. of hail. There, there are. Listen, listen. You liar. You said to me you are from Ibn Kathir. You are not. Means that there are mountains of hail in the sky. Read it for me. Then here we go. This is Ibn Kathir. It is in the tafsir of Ibn Kathir. Okay. So, Ibn Kathir, okay, listen, 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 so, Ibn Kathir, okay, listen, listen, Ibn Kathir, Ibn Kathir, when he quote the word Arabic one by one, then he says to you, this is a metaphor, metaphor of the, for the cloud, correct? Yeah, based on Arabic okay. dictionary as but well. But is it, is it in the Quran saying, isn't it you the one who says, go the word, Arabic word, word by word? So where is the word metaphor? No, no, I never said did, that. Did Allah, I never said that. Did, no, the, 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 the verse be, before it. Where is the word like? Like then the likeness of? Does it say like a cloud? Does it say like mountains? It says from mountains in it. Correct. Oh my God! I just explained to you okay, that the hold Quran on, has a way of saying going back forth and forth. Just to show you, the subject of just, the to, first just to show everybody that you. I'm not here to give Arabic lessons. Just to I'm show not you, here to give Arabic lessons. No, you are I here to give Arabic lessons. No, you are here to give Arabic lessons. He said it clearly. From there is there is meaning. Not there is, you clearly now because listen, you don't Arabic. Now listen, this is Ibn Kathir. I'm going to put for you in front of you Ibn Kathir, and now you will say Ibn okay. Kathir is a stupid, and you will run away, and you will, and you will hang up. Read carefully. This I'm, is not Ibn, running. I'm not running. I'm not running. I'm not. This is Ibn Kathir explaining chapter 86, verse number six and seven, saying that the Quran teach that women have a sperm coming from their ribs and the man have a sperm coming from his backbone. This is Ibn Kathir. Is that metaphor? Or this Go is to my scholars and ask them this question. Don't ask me. Don't ask me. I'm not a scholar. You are the one who quote for me. You are the one who quote for me, Ibn Kathir. You are the one who quote for me, Ibn Kathir. So suddenly, Ibn Kathir now is a stupid. Is he stupid or smart? 
I'm not answering the question. I'm answering why? this question. Why Don't no? go you see, around I showed you, I showed you al baghawi which Ibn Kathir, he learned from him. He caught him to explain things. So al baghawi go, go to my scholars al, 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 and accept their challenges. This they is, are open. This is the scar those are the scholars. Ibn, Ab Ibn Abbas, not Ibn Kathir. Ibn Abbas is the cousin of your prophet. And your prophet, he prayed for him to be Hebrew al-Ummah, the, the, the ink of knowledge of the, of the nation who can explain the Quran. So Ibn Abbas said, and I'm showing you I in the screen. Four times. I'm showing I you in the screen. Times. In the, the Arabic dictionary, by the way. In, the, in, the, fi sama jibalin min barad. in the sky. There's mountains Min of Jibal. Min Jibal. You're a liar. No problem. Min Jibal, you're you know stupid. Min Jibal. Min Jibal. Wait, my son, so man, he I said called... it from where? Even this is make it even more horrible. Min Jibal. Translate what Min Jibal mean. Mm -hmm. Translate. Go ahead. What Min Jibal mean? Translation based on the tafsir. It means and also on based on the Arabic It's a reference about the cloud. It's a reference about the cloud. Translate based on the tafsir. This is tafsir in front of you. This is Ibn Abbas. I can show you a Qurtubi, I can show you a Tabari, I can show you a Jalalain. So now, because you are a liar and we got you busted, you don't want any tafsir except you want only one tafsir. And when we show you Ibn, Ibn, Ibn Kathir himself, so, so in stupid things, he said, don't ask me about this. I don't care if he's stupid or not. You have, so, you have just read the verse three so, times so wrong. Listen, so the listen, listen, it says in Arabic, Min Jibalin Fiha, Allah he sent from mountains Fiha, where? In the sky, there is a jibal, correct? There's not like not like a cloud, mm -hmm. not like a cloud like mountains. No, min jibal in fiha. And here, Ibn based Kathir, on who? Based he, on who? And who? Based on who? On you? Not based on me. Based this, on who? This is Ibn Abbas. <laughs> <laughs> this is the case Ibn of your Kathir, Ibn Kathir. You're just you just misquoting, by the way. And this is Ibn Kathir. The in front of me, you have misquoted it three times, which means that and this, lying. And this is Ibn Abbas, and, and, taking words out of context. No, here we go. This Jibal is Ibn Abbas. is in the reference of the cloud. Listen, I listen, 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 listen. This is Ibn Abbas. This is Ibn Abbas. وقيل معناه وينزل من جبال في السماء تلك الجبال وينبرد. And then they quote Ibn Abbas. Ibn Abbas himself, he said the following. Read carefully. I didn't quote him. You quote him. I am quoting I him. Why, why not? Quoting why, exactly. I not quote Ibn Abbas? I why I will not quote Ibn Abbas? Suddenly Ibn Abbas is a garbage. Say he's a garbage. I will not quote him. I will quote someone else. Say, say Ibn Abbas is a stupid. Say it. Just say it. I'm not saying it. You are the one why who not? So why? So what's the problem with Ibn Abbas for you now? Is he a liar? It's not a problem for me. I just prefer no, another it's a problem for you. It's a it problem for you. you. It, is it, is a pro it is a problem for you because first you are fabricating an answer which is not existent. It is Quran. not. It is not. Secondly, if you give me five minutes, I'll open the tafsir and give you the tafsir of Ibn Abbas. But I don't want to waste the time of the viewer no, no, by no, just no, searching no, for verses. No, my friend. You are the one who is taking this part. This I will, I will give you tafsir Ibn Abbas. We don't, it doesn't take five minutes. Here we go. Let, me, let us do it in front of everybody. Everybody will laugh at you. This is tafsir Ibn Abbas. <clears throat> Here we go. Read and laugh. This is it. You said you can, if you Maybe give you me five minutes, you said, you said if you give me five minutes, you will open Ibn Abbas. It's Ibn Abbas is open. Read it. He sent down from heaven mountain where is hail. He sent down hail from mountains in heaven. This is Ibn Abbas. The one you, you threaten me, you want to show me what Ibn Abbas is saying. Here we go, it's in front of you. So you, you cannot say I don't accept it. And this is translated by you. This is the official government website of the Kingdom of Jordan. What happened? Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm you, not hearing you. Do you hear me? Come on, don't tell me you don't hear me. I'm showing you Ibn Abbas. He says that. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. I'm hearing uh, you. I'm, I'm hearing you now. I'm hearing okay. you. I'm hearing it, you. It says the. So, uh, so this is Ibn Abbas. This is Tafsir Ibn Abbas. I'm opening it. So uh, just listen to me. Okay. Okay. Yinazil min al sama min jibani fiha min barad. Right? Is that right? Hmm. Okay. Now I'm coming to Ibn Abbas. It means this is Ibn Abbas. Hmm. In the sky, mountains, barad, yanazillah, minhal barad, wamma minad jibal, shalu hanan. It is kinaya, kinaya, and it's hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Reference on the cloud. Hold on, this is Ibn Abbas. Ibn Abbas is in front of me. What are you reading? Ibn Abbas is in front of me. What are you reading? 
It is Ibn Abbas who is also in front. My friend, this is Ibn Abbas. Read for me. Let me give you the link. Give me a second. Let me give you the link so you can open it from your side. Go ahead. I will, I will take picture. No, 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 no. It's, it's okay. It's, it's okay. It's okay. Abbas. No, no. We want to read the same thing, me and you together. Okay. Here we go. Open the link. And this is the translation. There's no. I don't need. know from because, me reading. No, I don't know where. No, you know what I'm reading. This is the official government website. And this is of Jordan. And this is Ibn Abbas. And you do not need to translate and lie to me about translation. I do not need to translate. And you say to me, you are lying about translation. This is done by you Muslims, published by you. And this is your government website. Read for us. Go ahead. I just did. Okay, no read. I told you, I told you the mouth is it's Kenaya. Kenaya. No, read, read, read. No, read, no, read. No, no, this is not on the, the club. Doesn't say Kenaya. Doesn't say Kenaya. Read it. Read it. He sent okay. down. Wa min jibal. Wa min jibal huna. It's Kenaya and it's Sahaf. And from the second, he has this beginning of the story. Also, but it's not the first. 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 It And this is the link for what Ibn Abbas, he said in Arabic. By the way, this is the first time I download this app, so <laughs> I might not know how to use it. Just a minute. My friend, there's no need for it. I've just opened the click. The link is going to open for you in a different page. You say to you, you want to click again? Click oh, again. Oh, sorry. I did open it. I All did open it. All right. Does it say here, he sent down from heaven, from the heaven, mountains where is wherein is hail he says he sent down hail from mountains in heaven does it say that i'm reading sir okay He said he sends down hail mm -hmm. from mountains in heaven. Okay. And and with hail he punch punches. I don't know what that word is. Mm -hmm. And avert its pun, uh, punishment. No, read, read, my friend. Why, why? From whom he okay. will. So the, he the sent, of his let, let, let us read. You, you skip. You skip. I don't know why I was skipping. It says he sent down. He sent down. From he heaven, sent down hail from mountains in heaven. No, 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 you are not reading correctly, my friend. Read, 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 read. It says, He sent down after the water cloud. You see the water cloud? After that, there is a bracket. And oh, then it says, You want me to read from the yeah. issue is the mountain, so I'm reading from the mountain. Yeah, he said, He said, He sent down from he sent the heaven, down hail from, from mountains in heaven. Are you reading the same page I'm reading? Yeah. Yeah, 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 I swear. Okay. He no, read the line before it. Read the, hail from read, read, the line did not start here. Read the the, the top, the, the, the one in the top of it. It says he sent, there's a bracket. You see the bracket? It says he sent down from heaven, mountain where in is hail. Where is the mountains are in heaven? Where is the hail is in the mountain. And he continues saying, he says, he sent down hail from mountains in heaven. So where is the hail mm -hmm. coming from? Coming from mountains. This is what the Quran is saying. Which is Kinaya for clouds. Where is the word Kinaya? Does the Quran say it's My friend, my friend. From, from no, no, here we go. You cover. see, no, I showed you Al-Baghawi. I showed you Al-Jalalain. I showed you Ibn Abbas. I, all of them, it says he sent a, a, a hail from mountains in heaven. And I'm explaining you what that mountain is. 
انت كنايه هاو يو اكسبلين تو مي هاو ان ذا وورد يو اد ا وورد ان ذا قران از نوت داز الله هي سايز وات اي مينت باي ماونتن اي مينت ا كلاود ديد هي ساي ذات اور يو ار ميكين ثينجز اب نو 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 ام نوت ميكين ثينجز اب جست جيف مي ذا تايم تو اكسبلين ان ذا فيرست فيرس ان ذا فيرست فيرس اي تولد يو ذات فولماكن فوقها بعض فوق I want to give you. 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 I want to give you a sentence. Listen, listen. Don't don't force me to hang up on you because you are playing like a kid now. If do you agree with Ibn Kathir? I'm Say yes. Up. I'm not hanging up. Do you up. agree? Do you agree with Ibn Kathir against Ibn Abbas? Yes or no? I agree with Ibn Kathir and Qurtubi and Tabar in this question in this verse. Okay, guys. Do, do did he say he uh, agree with the Qurtubi? Do you agree with the Qurtubi? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let us go to the Qurtubi. Is that okay with you? Yeah, yeah. All no right. problem. So if we go to Al Qurtubi now, <clears throat> let us see what Al Qurtubi he says. This is Al Qurtubi in the front of your eyes. Read carefully and laugh with me. Qil. خلق الله في السماء جبال من برد. Translate. فهو ينزل منها بردا. Translate. Go ahead. You are the one who said you accept Al Qurtubi. This is the official government website of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, very well known. And this is Al Qurtubi. And this is what it says about that part of the verse. خلق الله why you don't translate خلق الله في السماء جبال من برد الله he created in the sky mountains of hills does it say that or I'm lying and he sent the hail from those mountains I'm reading I mean it's a sentence why it taking you too much time I highlight it for you translate for because, us because I'm reading because I'm reading sir Read not it. from the link that you sent me from of Ibn Qurtubi of this text here that is in front of me in Arabic <laughs> I have it in Arabic in front of me too. Translate where it says, خلق الله في السماء جبال من برد. Allah, he created in the sky mountains of hail. Am I lying or this is true translation? I'm, I'm giving you, if you give me a chance, I will explain. So it don't, says, don't, tell me, uh, am, I, am I lying or? You're not, I, telling, you're not letting um, me explain. I know, not letting I, you can explain as much as you want. Well, explain, this is the explanation. You want to explain the explanation? What's wrong with you? It says here, خلق الله no, في السماء. I'm reading. I'm reading the explanation. No, I'm reading it. Read I'm for reading me. It. Read for me. Don't waste my time. خلق الله في السماء جبال من برد. Does it say, Allah He created in the sky mountains of hills? Yes or I'm lying. And from those mountains, Allah He sent hail. Am I lying in the translation? You're mine. It has. Yeah, no, no. You are misunderstanding the translation. It says. ينزل خلق الله في السماء جبال من برد فهو نزل منها بردا فيه اضمار اضمار في نوع من العربيك which means he bring hail from mountain مفعول is محذوف وهذا قول الفراء لأن تقدير عنده التقدير عنده من الجبال برد so the mountain which is the hail and the hail is in the placement of Huffle. My friend, what are you so reading? Exactly oh, what, 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 listen, listen, what's wrong with you? Aren't you the one who asked me to read for you? Al this is the Qurtubi. Okay. This is the Qurtubi. Okay, does it say in Al Qurtubi, Allah, He created mountains of hail in the sky? Does it say that in the front of you? Yeah, but okay. there is all Mahdu. Hold on, hold on. This and is the Arabic so, language. So he, so he sent down, he sent down from it hail. Does it say that? Yeah, but I'm telling you, from all, right. all my well, even, 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 even if you say that, you're idiot. What's wrong with you? Continue reading. Quran. Continue reading. Are you, are, you, are, you, are you crazy or what? It says, قوله المعنى من جبال فيها بتنوين الجبال وقيل إن الله خلق في السماء جبال فيها. So, محذوف, not محذوف. This is still the same. Still, he's saying the same. There's mountains in the sky and there's hair is coming from them. Do you see it? 
I see it and I explained it 10 times. <laughs> Look, if you don't want to accept, if you don't want to accept my explanation, of course, it's a kinaya. If you don't like your it, explanation, go and explain you, it you with my scholars. You, you have a laugh at you. Said to me, you, want, you, 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 you said to me, it is kinaya. You said to me, it is kinaya. You accept. On two you here, said, it is kinaya. No, you said it to me, kinaya. you said you accept. You, it is you, kinaya, sir. You accept it is kinaya. Is and Al-Qurtubi is saying that. About this so, your God. Now, let me ask my question. Your, let me ask your my question. God, your God, he know about the deep sea, but he do not know where the, where the, where the hail is coming from? It doesn't say that in the verse. You are a liar. It doesn't say that in the verse. Okay. Can you translate the verse word by word? I did it 10 times. No, you if did you not. don't want to accept it, up no, to you. No, you did not. Let us move to a second no, question no, no, because I did no, it 10 not. times. You did not. Here let, we go. Let, let us do it, let us do it again. Let us do it again. Okay. okay. Oh, I, I am. I am. Or I am, the first one. Okay. Does it say anywhere in the verse, like the, from the cloud? Does it say he make it from the cloud? Does it say that or you are adding things? I'm not adding. I'm just told you it's a kinai. Okay. This is the language of the Quran. So, just like what kinai? He says it's, it's, it's so clear. I mean, I mean, look, you, guys, guys, look, 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 look. In the previous verse, he want me to go word by word, and then he said to me, "Say here, stop." Okay. Here we are going liar, word by word. Liar! Liar! You got busted. <laughs> you, you are a liar. I never said. I never said that. Get back, guys, to the video and see if I really said that. Aren't Goodbye. you the one? Aren't you, really the, aren't you the, the one who it. said to me, the, the letter G is a stop? It's a stop. Yes. Okay. And then the word zulmat go back to the mouth. Yes. Okay. Because it says layers on top of each other. It's All a right. reference for the first All right. One. Okay. So Allah here, he described first the cloud. And then he said from between the cloud, Allah, he do things. There's a cloud, they come. And there is water come from it. And then he continued and said, وَيُنِزِلُوا Additional and. And from the sky. So this is the new sentence. And from the sky, Allah, he, from the sky, from mountains. Min Baladin, he uses it. It's a Kinaya. Where is Kinaya? It's okay. Kinaya. Okay. From Ab 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 Abdul, it's Abdul, 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 Abdul. I give, I gave you the uh, tafsir. I'll send you the which, name. Which, I'll send you the name. Which tafsir? It's Kinaya. Okay. So are you saying to me that you must have Tafsir Ibn Kathir and Ibn Qurtubi. Okay. Listen. No Al Qurtubi in front of me. Don't lie. No, I'm not lying. I'll send you the link. I'll okay. send you the link. Okay. I'll send you the link. Okay. Okay. Let me send you. Look like you do not know how to read, like your prophet. Huh? I will send you the text and you read for us. And you know what? I can use Google. I don't want to read your text. I, I don't want to read your link. Uh, okay, listen, the listen, link is in front of me and I read it. Listen. Time. I read it two okay. times, maybe four I will, times. I will, if you don't want to accept it, I will, it, use, this is I will use Google Translation. Everybody will laugh at you. Either you are lying or lying. Is that okay? Go to Arabic dictionary. Don't tell you, you stop have playing the game. Stop playing, playing the game. Dictionary. If we use Google Translation for this page, do you accept whatever the Google translation is saying to get you busted or got me busted? I don't accept Google translation. It's not even academic. It's not even academic. Hey, okay, so, so why why you are not reading what it says then for me then? It says in the front of you. Here I explain to you based on two tips here. I explain to you based on two tips here. You don't want to. Are we going to move on from this question? This is al No, time. I want to get you busted. So I I have now no choice. I got you busted two times. Listen, I got you busted. I you said, deny it. You said deny you want to show me. You, like you, said you, said, you, said, you said you want to show me Ibn Abbas. I showed you Ibn Abbas in English. says it clearly Allah. He sent hail from mountains in heaven. Does it say that or not? This is the English one. It says that, but it doesn't, it doesn't explain about the Kinai from Ibn Qurtubi and Ibn Tafsir. Uh, so so that means there's no Kinai, there's no, there's no met metaphorical, there's nothing. That, don't, don't, be, don't be stupid. It says here, he sent down, this is Ibn Abbas, this is the highest. By the way, by the way who's John? By the way, who's nasty on John? <laughs> Who are they exactly? Okay. Do you Who are they? Do you, you have a, I, a chain of okay. narration? I promise, I promise, you, they, I promise you, if you are a man, we finish and we talk about John. You stupid idiot. I can ask you the same question. Who is Salih? Who is Muhammad in the whole Quran? We do not know who is Muhammad. Who is Muhammad? If you if you read if you read the Bible you will oh see my God. John there is a whole chapter himself. about Muhammad. Listen, Goodbye, no, there's no, there's no chapter Have about a good Muhammad. Day. There's no chapter about Muhammad. You Muslims call it Muhammad. Secondly, who is Muhammad? 
You do not know. But don't change topic. He's the last prop. You, you don't change the topic. It's you're naked. coward. You're by coward. Way, you're coward. Way, you're coward. I will use, Solomon, I will use Google, trans I will use Google Translation. Here we go. I will use Google Translation because this coward, he refused to read. Let us use Google Translation. Give, give me a second. It's uh, not academic Google Translation. It doesn't matter. It shows me your matter. level of knowledge. It's going to show who is lying. It, it's not academic. Are you academic too? Now you want academic. I go so, to dictionary. Hold, hold like on. Oxford hold dictionary. On, this on. is the academic way. Yeah, a dictionary. Exactly. What does dictionary have to do with this? Dictionary is going to explain the Quran now? Dictionary, dictionary explain a, a word. It, it explains the vocabulary of the Quran. It explains the vocabulary it, of the Quran. No problem. A word. A word in the Quran does not explain the, the Quran. Now let us go there. Hold on. I will use Google Translation. For some reason, it's showing me Azerbaijani, which is very funny. Let us search for our Arabic. Give me a second. Everybody will see in a second how Muslim they lie when they translate. Uh, we don't translate for translator, guys. Go and have a laugh in Google Translate. Why, 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 why you don't want to translate from a translator? Because you refuse to translate for me. You refuse. I go to Arabic dictionary. Sir. Okay, I oh, go to Arabic okay. dictionary. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm like you, I'm academic. For, for some reason, the page is not opening. Let us see. Hold on. Give, give me a second. I will open Google Translation. I will copy that the text in the front of everybody. Here we go. It's not academic. In doesn't university, you are, you are afraid. Or you are, copy in you are afraid. You are afraid. Wikipedia. Doesn't matter. It's a so software. Unacademic. It's a so unacademic. it's a blind software. Is going to get you busted. If it says what you are saying, is going to show there too. It's a it's a blank. I'm not so accepting anything from Google Translate. It's not up to I you. Go okay. by, by the I, I am I am here. Arabic dictionary. Okay. I am, here. I am here. I am here to get you busted. Here we go, guys. I will copy the text in the front of you to show you why this coward. It's not don't... academic. Not doesn't, acceptable. Uh, not doesn't acceptable. matter. It's a plain software. Either you are lying or I am lying. <laughs> <laughs> they, in the university, they give you zero from Google Translator. Which, which part you are? Listen, by the way, I will, I will give by the way, you, guys, you by the way, potato, potato. second Samuel, I will give you, I will give you an option. Samuel I will give you first Chronicle has a contradiction in the Bible. Uh, here we go. Let's not talk about coward, Let's coward, not talk about coward. Coward. We will talk about the Bible. Let us not talk about Translate. I want to give you a chance. You guys have a disaster in the Bible. Potato, I want to give you a chance. I want to give you a chance to choose for me what to copy text to post it in Google Translation. Can you do that? I will give you a chance. Okay, I can do that. I can do that. I can oh, do that. All right. Here we okay. go. Okay. Can mm. I speak? Go ahead. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Second Samuel 24 9, first Chronicle <laughs> 21 5 has a we big cup of the king. We will go to second Word Samuel. Missing. No problem. Word potato, 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 potato. So you are, you are coward and you, you are. You, I you, said you, to you are goodbye. You, so you want to see? speak about Google Translation? See, make guys, a point? see really? guys, see guys, see guys. Okay, okay. He, he hang up. Cover. If we go right now and we copy the text, you will see how this person is a fraud. Right away, because we show them all the interpretation, we show them all the mean. The verse is so clear. It's so clear. Allah, He created mountains in the sky. And here, you know, he said, like, this is a tabari. Let me go first to Al Qurtubi, the one he chose. This is Al Qurtubi, because this is the one he chose. All right. All right. I will copy the text in the front of you. And then you will see that nowhere in what in the text he is what he is saying. He can like he insists Al Qurtubi. That there is Allah, He created mountains, and those mountains are in the sky. And He mean that that Allah He sent hail from those mountains, and the verb here is deleted, which means you know, like He did not mention what He do exactly. But it says it clearly that He have mountains. And those mountains are in the sky. وَقِيلَ إِنَّ اللَّهَ خَلَقَ تَعَالَى خَلَقَ السَّمَاءَ فِي السَّمَاءِ جِبَالٍ فِيهَا بَرَدٍ فَيَكُونُ التَّقْذِيرُ Or the meaning. وَيُنِزِلُ مِنَ السَّمَاءِ مِنْ جِبَالٍ فِيهَا بَرَدٍ Go to Google Translation. Call me back, coward.
why he don't want Google translation? It's a it's a plain tech software. Doesn't take your side, doesn't take my side. And it was said, God Almighty created mountains in the sky that contain hail. So the estimate is he descended from the sky from mountains where is ice. That's why he don't want it. He don't want us to to use Google Translation. I mean, this is software. Will not take my side. Will not take his side. If what he is saying is there, as he claimed, then it should show. He said, "Show me Ibn Abbas." I showed him Ibn Abbas. He said, "Ibn Kathir." We showed him Ibn Kathir. Even Ibn Kathir is saying. That it says, Allah, he sent hail from mountains in heaven. This is the exact word in Quran. So add in your own fabrication saying maybe like, like from the cloud. It doesn't say that. And the top of that, this is Ibn Abbas. In the top of that, this is Al-Qurtabi. In top of that, this is Al-Tabari. In the top of that, this is Al-Jalalain. This is Al-Jalalain. Here we go. Let us go to Al-Jalalain. See, this is Ibn Abbas. I will switch to Al-Jalalain. So Allah, he knew about the deep sea. But Allah in a deep poo when it's come to the sky. And he sent down from heaven, from the heaven, out of mountains. Does it say out of mountains like a cloud? Or a cloud like mountains? No. Why the mountains here, according to Allah, are solid mountain? Because we are talking about ice, hail, hard, like a rock. Do you see it? Call me back, call me back, so we can have fun. <laughs> Let me call him, you know. Uh-oh, he's rejecting my call. <laughs> Come on, buddy. <laughs> so look at this madness. Allah, brothers and sisters, he knew what is inside the deep sea. And because he knew what is inside the deep, he talked talk about the cloud. What the cloud have to do with the deep sea? And what the waves in the top of the sea have to do with the deep sea to make it dark? Simply, the Quran is speaking about a crazy, wavy sea. Your God did not know how the baby is made. Your God did not know. When I showed him Ibn Kathir saying that women, they have a sperm coming from their ribs, he said, I don't care about Ibn Kathir. But you are the one who said to me, let's do Ibn Kathir. Isn't it you who said that to me, let's go to Ibn Kathir? He created it from water gushing forth, meaning a sexual fluid that come out forth, breasting, forth from the man and the women, wonderful science. And then he says, proceeding from between the backbone and the ribs, meaning the backbone of the man and the ribs of the women. Science. Allah, he knew what is inside the deep sea, but he did not know what is inside the women private part. And he think that women have a sperm and it's it's a sexual fluid gushing forth coming from her ribs. Who's next? Let me try to call him again. Man, Man the poor guy. Right away, let us go to Second Samuel. Who's John? Who's John? Okay, who's John? So you see, guys, when you when you step in his tail, who who who's John? When the Bible says who is John, we have books of tradition tell us every, everything about John, everything about Luke. But who is Muhammad? Even the Bible says who is his father? Who is you know who is his brother? But when we read the Quran, he said there is a chapter in the Quran, it's called the chapter of Muhammad. Okay, who is who is Muhammad? Is Muhammad a name? Muhammad means the praised one. There's no way. The Quran sometimes call Muhammad Muhammad, sometimes call him Ahmad. Which one is one? If he is Muhammad, he cannot be Ahmad. 
Is he Ahmed or Muhammad? Simply because they will say to you, oh, it have the same meaning. So it's a title, it's not a word, it's not a it's not a name. Who who what is the name of your prophet? There's no name. They do not know what Allah means, they do not know what Muhammad means, they do not know. I mean, we know what Muhammad means, but we do not know what Muhammad, who is Muhammad, and how Muhammad became Ahmad. Why Isa he said there is a prophet will come after me, his name is Ahmad. Between two bracket, Ahmad, i.e. Muhammad. Uh -huh. How Muhammad became Ahmad? And Isa did not say there's a prophet will come after me. According to your Quran, his name is Muhammad. He said Ahmad. How he is the same person? Any Muslim? No, I don't have it. Uh, maybe somebody have a Tabari in English, you know. Yeah, but if you want the link for Al Qurtubi, here we go. This is Al Qurtubi, the one he was arguing about, and you can use Google Translation on your side. On all of you, use it. Here we go. You see, we go to Google Translation as a final result because either him is lying or me is lying. Open the page, you click translate, you will find the translation. It's a plain software, it's not taking a side, it's not a Christian software, it's not a Jewish software, it's a software. Whatever text you insert inside is going to translate for you. For sure the translation will not be perfect, but will show you who is lying. <clears throat> Guys, I apologize, I have to turn on the heater, I'm freezing. Give me a second. I turn it off when I go online, but man, my legs is hurt from the cold. Ooh, yeah. But Allah always he keeps me warm. Christian Prince, you did lie to Christian Prince. I'm going to cut you busted. <laughs> So Allah, he sent hail from mountains in heaven. Suddenly they have to add words in the translations. Suddenly they have to come. Look, look at the translation, guys. Look at translation. It says here, <clears throat> he sent down from the heaven mountains where is hail. Look at the translation here. Do you see? This is, this is a Muslim translation. If you change the translator, this is who? Let us see who this is who. This is Big Tal. Big Tal is trying to be honest here compared to the rest. This is Big Tal. Muhammad Big Tal. Okay. What it says here? He sent down from the heaven mountain where from, from the heaven mountains where is hail. Now translation here is not really accurate. He says from the heaven he should add from the heaven from mountains to make it more accurate let us go and change the translator when you change the translator i warn you you will find a new quran this one his name is Kar, uh, Ka, Karar, karai i never heard of this guy before let us see <clears throat> and he sent down hail from the sky out of mountains well huh? this guy is being honest Guys, do you see anywhere it says like, like from the sky, from a cloud, like mountains? Do you see the word cloud? No. It's a Muslim translation. He sent down hail from the sky out of mountains. So how you start saying this is metaphor and this, it says simple language. He sent down hail from the sky out of mountains. This is what the this is your Muslim translation. Let us let us change, and now you will see when you change the translator. Usually, you get a new Quran. They will start inserting like like cloud like mountains. This is Muhammad Asad. Let us see what Muhammad Asad will say. Ah, this is the long. Here we go, Muhammad Asad, the fraud. Here we go, guys. And then he sent down from the sky by degrees 
mountains mass of a cloud look 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 suddenly in this translation we have masses of a cloud and the Muslim they say that we don't corrupt our Quran masses of a cloud that charged with hail well how come the previous translation have nothing like this I mean what happened we go back to the previous translation he sent down hail from sky out of mountains anyone see cloud anyone see the word charge with ice we go to the other translation it's a miracle suddenly there's a new word there <laughs> change the translator so anyway you can do that yourself but here the funny is that this God is as smart when they want and he's a stupid when they want or they play stupid when they want to save Allah so if Allah is speaking about the deep sea as you claim here and the darkness of the deep sea simply he do not need to use the word the cloud at all because the darkness of the deep sea have nothing to do with the stormy weather it can be the most nice day and the sun in the middle of the sky still you cannot see your finger in the deep sea so the cloud here by Allah mentioning the word the cloud here he got the, the, the Muhammadan busted because now it's so clear and the word Lujay or Lujay is a word can be used about deep but if you say the sea is deep, this is stupid. I mean, the sea is deep always. But you can say a water which is deep, if you are saying the word water. But the second you say the word bahar, obviously you say the word deep. It's, this is why we call it bahar. Bahar is a deep water. This is why we call something, it's a, a huge amount of water and it is deep. Otherwise, we will not call it bahar, we will call it a lake. So when we say Lujay, and then he describe it after that, saying that there's wave after wave after wave, he described that it's a crazy ocean, crazy sea, stormy weather. And this is what in dictionary says, Lujay is a great wavy ocean or sea. And by the way, as long as we are talking about the word Bahar and the coward he ran away, do you know that Allah... He said that, as long as we are talking about Bahar, you know, that Allah created two kinds of seas. And those two seas, one is fresh water and one is salty, and they are forbidden from me together. If you go right now and search in YouTube, you will find the Muslim, they make a story, or let's say a scientific miracle. He says, Allahu Akbar, look, the water in the sea and the fresh water are not mixing, brother. My friend, that's stupid. Fresh water and the water of the sea, they mix every second. Don't fool yourself. When there is a current, it takes time, but it's mixing. If you don't believe me, go get a cup full of salt, mix it with water, and then put a container, big container, not small, like just make the salt small if you want, just to show you how silly you are. And then flip the cup, which is full of water and salt, and put it in the big container. And let us see if it's going to mix. <laughs> Here it says it's forbidden. There is a ban. And if we go to Ibn Kathir, you will see Ibn Kathir saying, Allah, he created a barrier of a rock between the two seas. One is salty and one is a fresh, so they cannot meet what kind of God he says such a thing that fresh sea and salty sea there is a barrier between them there is two seas two seas if you read the translation here it says two great bodies of water where is two where is the word two great bodies? it says in Arabic Bahrain 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 two seas if you change the translator in a miraculous way, you will find a new translation, a new meaning. Suddenly the word two C's will appear. Let's go. Read carefully.
It is he who has let free the two seas. Do you see two seas? Between two brackets, two kinds of water. <laughs> you know, when, we, when they want the word sea is a sea, when they want, it's two kinds of water, brother. Hmm. One is a fresh and sweet, and the other one is salty and bitter. And he put a complete partition between them. Complete. So why you make a video says that the water of the sea and the water of fresh water is not mixing when they are touching each other already and they are mixing. It says here complete partition. If you go to Ibn Kathir, the same book he chose for us. This is a chapter of 25 verse number 53. Let us go to Ibn Kathir. 25. Fifty-three. Here, Ibn Kathir, he will get them busted with their lies about this, the, the fresh water and the salty water. They mix together. It's, uh, they meet together in the ocean, brother, and they don't mix, brother. Allahu Akbar. Read carefully. وَجَعَلَ بَيْنَهُمَا بَرَزَخًا وَحِجْرًا Okay, what is that? He set a barrier, complete partition between them, meaning between the, 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 sweet, uh, the sweet water and the salty water. Barrier mean a dry land. Do you see it? Mean what? A dry land. So the stupid God of Islam, who Muslims, they, they claim that he knew what is inside the deep sea, he is teaching us that salty water and fresh water, they never mix and they have nothing to each other. Like Allah created salty water alone in a sea and he created the fresh water in different sea and they never mix. But all of us, we knew that this is stupid because all the fresh water we have is coming in a cycle motion from the sea. The sun will heat the water in the ocean then that will become a form of a steam and then the steam will become a cloud and then the cloud will be driven by wind will go over the land and then when they face like a, a different temperature then either rain will happen or ice will happen or snow will happen according to the stupid god of islam there is a barrier between a fresh water and salty water and they are forbidden to meet each other And the proven in front of you. They cannot transgress. Bainahuma Barzahun La Yabagiyan. They cannot touch each other. Finito. Complete partition. How this is can be from God? And now, who is who is John? Tell me who is John. Okay, tell me who is John. Like my friend, who are talking about this verse. Let us finish it. Okay, can we use Google Translation? Who is John? Uh, by the way, there's a contradiction in Second Samuel. What? Uh, what? There's a contradiction in Second Samuel. You know, he say it fast because, like, suppose he wanna hang up. You know, he will run away. Your Quran is the book of contradiction. Call me and prove me wrong. And here, you notice how uh, selective they are. You know, when they want Ibn Kathir is good. Okay, do you accept Ibn Kathir? I don't care about Ibn Kathir. So why you are quoting Ibn Kathir? Let me read for you Ibn Abbas. Okay, this is Ibn Abbas in front of you. Read it. Suddenly he don't want to read it. Any Muhammadan want to say anything to us? I 
I, you know, I, I got you busted. I, I, you were lying yesterday. Hmm. It's very simple. If the God of Islam is speaking about the deep sea, he will not mention putting his hand out to see it because a human being don't live in the sea. And he will not mention the cloud. And he will say clearly, if you go down deep inside the sea and you put your hand out, you will not see. There is no need for a metaphor and uh, the, 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 the games of the grammar they play. And you do not need to mention the word the cloud. Cloud have nothing to do with the deep sea. And it's not a secret that if you dive in the ocean, the more you go down, is going to be dark. And people, they used to dive really deep, even in the time of Muhammad. Because this is the only way to search for pearls. Actually, as long we are talking about diving, let us talk about science. Isn't it the Quran says that Suleiman, he have divers and they are shaitan? And they dive for him? Muslims, is that true? And also shaitan, the devils, they are builders and divers. Eh? Suleiman, he have shaitan working for him as a builder and diver. Science. And what they built for him? They built for him palaces and synagogue with the statues. Look, I thought Islam is against the statues. And then the brother, Shaitan, he stole the ring of Suleiman. Yes, brother, Prophet Suleiman, he went to the bathroom. And when he go in the bathroom, he don't take the ring of Allah with him. So he gave it to his wife, her name is al -Jarada. When Suleiman was in the bathroom, squeezing it and freezing it, and it's not coming, Satan, he come to her, his wife in the look of Suleiman. Hmm. Christian friends, do you understand something called a metaphor? If not, then explain, do you believe that God, Father, is gender and Jesus divine? You see, uh, inshallah, we can go with metaphor as much as you want, but here, is that a metaphor? Is that a metaphor? Is it metaphor when the Muslim they say, Allah, he have a hand? Or Allah have a foot? Is it metaphor when Allah, he says there is two seas? Is it metaphor when Allah, he says there is hail of mountains in, in the sky? So this is a funny argument. Is it metaphor when Allah, he says the women have a sperm coming from her ribs? And man have a sperm coming from his backbone? Is it metaphor when Allah, he says that sperm became a congealed dead blood? If this is a metaphor, call me and tell me metaphor of what? Correct people? Because look like you know what metaphor mean and we don't. And for sure, I will be happy to learn from someone like you. Inshallah. And look, even your name is Inshallah. So can I say Inshallah, you will never call me ever because you are afraid? Is the Quran saying that Shaitan, he died for Suleiman is a metaphor? Is the Quran saying that she, uh, uh, the ant, she spoke to the ant is a metaphor? Is the Quran statement about the flying carpet is a metaphor? Call me and tell me about metaphor. I want to learn from you. Christian Plans, you don't know what metaphor. We are Muslims, we can teach you about metaphor. Are you there, Mr. Inshallah? I took a selfie for you, smile. Are you there?
metaphor. The ring of Solomon is a metaphor. The flying carpet of Solomon is a metaphor. Al-Hudhud, the bird who is a general in the army of Suleiman. Suleiman, he have an army of birds, chickens. Suleiman, he died in the chair and nobody noticed that he is dead. Anyone knows how, how they find out that he's dead? The guy is almost dead for a year. He dies standing holding his stick. It happened to me once, happened to me. It happened all the time to all people. And then brother and sisters, the ministers and the wives of Suleiman did not notice that Suleiman is dead, brother. So brother, then Allah, he sent the termite. And the termite, they start eating the stick. And you know, the termite, they eat. But they eat slow, brother. You know, they don't eat too much food. And the stick of Suleiman was very thick. He was using an oak tree. And then after a year, brother, Suleiman, he, the stick broken. And then they noticed that he is dead, brother. I mean, you idiot. The guy is dead, standing on a stick, and nobody noticed that he is dead. Any Muslim metaphor? Huh? Are you saying that Quran is not a metaphor? Yeah, Quran is not a metaphor. Quran is something you do. How is it going to be a metaphor? You recite from your memory. Is that metaphor too? Even metaphor, Quran is a metaphor? You idiot. <coughs> and guys, the stories of Suleiman, you will not believe. The shaitan who stole, let us go actually, let us see what Ibn Kathir say about this verse. You want to see it? I should go actually soon, but you guys made me lose my day. I will have to, I have many things to do. Unbelievable. Look, if we go right now to Ibn Kathir, see what Ibn Kathir is saying. Or go to Al-Qurtubi or al tabari you will die laughing. Chapter 38, verse number 34. We tested him and we placed on his throne just said a body. Mm -hmm. So he is not there. <laughs> and by the way, here they skip all that interpretation in Arabic. That's it, it's gone. Where is the story about what happened? And then right away they jumped that Allah He gave Solomon, Solomon a flying carpet. He's a brother. He have a flying carpet. And where is the translation in Arabic? What happened? Why the English is so short? If you go and check what is in Arabic, this is a tabari. You will see. وَلَقَدْ ابْتَلَيْنَا سُلَيْمَانَ وَأَلْقَيْنَا عَلَى كُرْسِيهِ جَسَدَ شَيْطَانٍ متمثلاً بإنسان and we like we uh, tested Suleiman you know we gave him a bad 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 thing and we made Shaitan sit on his chair as a human and this Shaitan his name is Sahar <laughs> and some they say his name is Asif <laughs> and some they say his name is Asar and some they say his name is Habqiq I mean, what's wrong with you Muslims? What's his name, man? I'm getting dizzy. And then the story, brother, and uh, 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 Satan, which is, uh, uh, he took this, the, the ring of Suleiman, he threw the ring in the ocean. And the kingdom of Suleiman, or his kingdomship, was in his ring. And the genie, his name is Sakhar. Mm -hmm. True story. If you read the story here in Arabic, you will die laughing. Let me give you the link. You can use Google Translation. Give me a second. You can use Google Translation. I wish they would translate those books to English so we can die laughing. 
Science, this is science, brother. This is science, yeah, true. This is absolutely clear science. I mean, what's wrong with you? This is a pure science. This is all what science is about. Okay. So now this is a tabari, which a tabari, by the way, is nicer from other stupid books. This is smarter. Translate to English. I hope it's going to work because this was showing me as Azerbaijan, you know. Okay. Let us read the tabari in the Prophet Google, be upon him. So Allah, he put a body on his throne. The translation is not too accurate, but you know, it's a software. And he put in his throne a genie, Shaitan. They say his name is Asif, and it was said his name, not the president. <laughs> president. <laughs> I mean, Google is funny. And his name, and some they say his name is Habkik. And about which he said people in the interpretation he mentioned, who he said Abu Saleh, he said in the authority, blah, 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 blah. We throw his body in the chair. He said, his, uh, it's, it's a genie, his name is Rok, not a Rok. It's a genie, his name is Rok, or Shaitan. He's a Shaitan, his name is Rok. And then, uh, let us see. From, 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 from the body, the devil who, to whom Suleiman pushed his ring, and then he threw it into the sea. True story. And the, the Suleiman, his kingdom was in his ring. The translation here, the, the region, it says his kingdom or his authority, it was his ring. This is the Lord of the, the Ring. You know the movie? The guy who took the ring off, that's it. He's not a king no more. He lost his kingdom. And if you read the rest of the story, you will die laughing, literally. There is a, a genie, he come to the sea seven times. If, 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 if. And he was in the spring in the middle of the sea, Ainul Bahar, where the water of the sea come, because they believe that there is a spring where the sea of the water come. And he used uh, this genie, his shaitan, he go there every seven days. And he took the water from the middle of the sea and he put their wine. <laughs> they are trying. They are trying to say to you how he create how the wine is created. Makes sense. I mean, who can deny that? Translation again is not correct. This genie or this uh, Afrit or this uh, uh, Shaitan, he go to the middle of the sea where there is a, uh, uh, like a, a, a water in the middle of the sea, in the eye of the sea. And then he go there every seven days. And then he made from that, uh, in, in that water, he put their wine so that like, the wine keep coming. All right. And then, uh, what? I mean, this translation here. Uh, it's uh, it's so he he tried it he you know he made some something it's then he called it wine he says mm, yummy you taste good ah, aha, I like your wine you are making the one who is old young and you make the one who is ignorant more ignorant so he like it shaitan he like it and then when he come back he became so thirsty until he came to the where the wine is and he said oh you are so good taste let me drink it from you etc and then he drank from it and then his his brain is gone you make the ignorant ignorant and he said he come back until he's very thirsty and then he come to the eye of the uh, of the wine and he said you have a good drink you tasty you are you, you are so tasty mm, i love you it's so good and you make the ignorant ignorant and you made the one uh, uh, the old, the young, and etc. And then, brother, he, uh, the this uh, this uh, genie, he came to Suleiman. Yes, brother. So he came to Suleiman, and he brought it for him. And he said, 
we've been ordered to build the house and it's been said that you don't hear the sound of iron in it what does that mean don't, don't ask me and then he brought the eggs of the hoopoe I mean what does have to do with this wine C genie iron building a house and suddenly we are jumping to the egg of the hoopoe hmm and he put the egg of the hoopoe inside the glass uh -huh. okay and he go around it <laughs> this is Hajj Kaaba <laughs> and then after he go uh, around it uh, he was looking at the egg and he cannot see it so they put the egg inside this jar and he go around it and he cannot get the eggs and then he went and he brought diamond so he saw the eggs but he cannot he cannot take the egg so he went and he brought a diamond alhamdulillah and then he put a diamond on it and he cut the glass mean and then he was able to get the eggs do we have any muslim have any comment and then since then they learn how to use diamond to cut stones see islam explain to you how things come to exist technology it was satan trying to eat the eggs inside the jar they put the eggs inside the jar he cannot open the jar so he went and he got a diamond and then he cut the glass and he got the egg hey we got the egg we got the egg and since then people they learn how to cut stones with diamond And guys, look, I mean, look at the story, how it's connected. So if Suleiman wanted to enter the wash, what does have to do with the topic before it? Well, so if Suleiman, he wanted to enter the washroom or the bathroom, he did not enter it with his ring. <sighs> so what the connection between the egg and cutting the door with the diamond and then suddenly we are talking about the bathroom of Suleiman and the ring of Suleiman what is that no just don't ask when they he went to the bathroom and Satan stole it Actually, the translation is not accurate. So, if Suleiman want to enter the bathroom, he don't enter with the ring. And then Suleiman, he took the ring from Solomon, and he start doing boom boom with the wives of Solomon. So when he entered the bathroom, brother, Satan, he took his ring and he threw it in the sea. And then a fish, she ate the ring. You know, fish, they like ring, by the way. Always, you know, like when I used to go and do, do fishing a long time ago, always I get a ring inside the fish this is the first time I look sometime like I was hoping like lately they would change the ring thing and they would get like a car a brand new car keys or something it's not working until now so brother he throw it the, I mean it's, it's a true story true story hmm
and Suleiman he starts sorry this this shaitan he starts having sex with the wives of Suleiman and how the wives of Suleiman notice that this person is not their husband because he looked like him they notice that he is so good in boom boom he never stopped they said what happened to our husband Hmm. Any one of you did save the link? Let us ask this question. How many of you click Google Translation after I post the link for you? So you can see what I'm talking about. Because maybe I'm lying. This is the link. This is the official government website of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. And then they say to you that the Quran is the book of science. A lot of science. By the way, I don't wear a ring in my hand for a purpose. What if one day, this is metaphorical, right? What if one day I go, let us say I get married, and then I give my ring to my wife, and then look what will happen. Shaitan, he is obsessed with rings. He will come and he will take the look of me when I am in the bathroom and look like I'm going to stay there for a century. And then he sleep with my wife and still I'm in the bathroom. And then he sleep with my second wife and still I'm in the bathroom. And Suleiman, he have 100 wife according to that page there. It says 100 wife. And still he is in the bathroom. I mean, put yourself in the shoes of Suleiman. Suleiman, he had 100 women. And one of them, his name is Ajarada. And she was one of his wives preferred to him. Anyone remember the story about this woman? This is the woman who cut the head of a, of a king by his high heels. Do you remember the story? We mentioned it to you before. She is the daughter of half a human, half genie. So the father, he was a minister for that king. And that father, he the king, who is his boss, he sleep with women who they are beautiful. They take them from their husband. So once brother, he take, he come to this woman to sleep with her. The father of this girl, he told Suleiman about her. He told him, why you don't marry my daughter? She is half a human, half zini. And then this king, he came to rape her. And she told him, it's not right to enter with all your army to have boom boom with me. Are you afraid from me? The king, he was so proud. He said, no. Okay, all soldiers, stand down. Don't enter with me. And he went inside her house to do boom boom. And then when he entered boom boom, she took off her shoe and she cut his head with her high heels. And this is why I'm warning you, women are dangerous. Especially women with high heels. This is this is not a story I'm making. Any Muslim, you want to challenge me, I can show you the reference. Don't go there, you know. So she cut his head with her shoe. And then she threw it to the soldiers. And then when the soldiers, they say that, they said, okay, if with high heels can do that, what if she do some weapon, let her run away. True story. Do we have any uh, people of science here? Huh? Each time Suleiman he wanna have orgasm, he take off the ring. Eh? <laughs> what is the connection between his orgasm and his? <laughs> And then the brother to make it sort of brother so when you know Suleiman he lost his kingdom brother and Satan start having boom boom with his wife brother he was humiliated he became a fisherman brother uh, so one day he found he went to the sea and he ended up with a fisherman and he was so hungry and his hunger became so severe so he ate the fish 
from their fishing. Uh, how he got the fish? Brother. Brother. He's so angry. He want to eat the fish and he is hungry and they don't want to give him the fish. So the birds came and they fly in the top of him. Yes, brother. And then they noticed that this must be Suleiman. So they apologized from him and they gave him two fists. And then when he ate the fish, he found the ring inside the fish. And then after he became a king again, Allah, he gave him the power of the flying carpet. Hmm. Science, right? Science. And then, brother, at the end of the story, brother, he opened the belly of the fish, so you can sleep now nicely and help you tell the story. So he opened the fish belly, and he found inside the fish belly, he found his ring. And this is how he became again a king. And brother and sisters, this is a true story, alhamdulillah. If there is any Muslim have it there to say, I object this story, They don't dare. Maybe next time we go live, we can talk about the ring of cinnamon. So just for entertainment purpose. Uh, anyway, guys, it's already we are three hours live. And even though I was saying to myself, I have things to do, I'm going to make it 15 minutes. So when Christian Prince, he wanted to make a 15 minute videos, his video goes three hours. I'm so good in timing unbelievable imagine you are my friend and we are going like i said to you wait for me outside for 15 minutes and you are waiting like did he say 15 minutes yes brother 15 minutes for a christian prince is like a thousand years for allah <laughs> uh, <clears throat> my friend don't ask me to read sahir bukhari now sahih muslim come on at three hours it's done i'm done i have to go i have work to do Unbelievable! I have the, I need to buy the bread and food and uh, come on, I'm, uh, you know. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's fifteen minutes. You know, it's just a fifteen minute. Time goes so fast, especially when we have Abdul with us, who is trying to get us busted. I got you busted, Second Samuel. Mm, true story. Yeah. <laughs> no, if I call Zachary Naik and ask him about the story, Zachary Naik will get me busted. He will say, Brother Tata, the Christian Prince, he make fun of the story of the Taman. First of all, if you watch the movie, the Bend of the Ring, you will see that this is a true story. The person and all the kingdom they are fighting over the ring. Because the one who wears the ring, he can control the world. So you don't believe it. How can you believe in the Holy Buddha movie and you don't believe in the story of Taman? So it's proven that the story of Taman is very true. And Taman, yes, he has a flying carpet. Before the boing, boing, boing. And look what happened in Indonesia. People they fly in the boing boing, they die. But if you have the flying carpet of Taliban, brother, you will not die. Thank you very much. Okay, but, but what we can say, I mean, the flying carpet of Solomon, the ring of Solomon, the bird of Solomon, the chicken of Solomon. Solomon, he have a general, his name is Hubub. He's in charge of water. He's a minister of water and irrigation and find women who have no hair in the legs for Solomon. I want to get that bird. I mean, isn't it nice to find a woman she have no hair in her legs, especially for us Middle Eastern? Our women are very hairy. If the woman, she stopped doing uh, what they call it sugar, for a month she will turn into a gorilla. I'm just joking. <laughs> we are hairy, it's a fact, you know. Once I was swimming in the swimming pool, they kicked me out. They said, you cannot, wear, you cannot swim with your clothes. I said, I'm not wearing my clothes, this is my hair. Like, hello. So, obviously, 
Suleiman, he have a pain. He cannot find the one woman, Middle Eastern woman, she is not full of hair. And then the bird, he found him, the queen of Saba. She have no hair in her legs. Alhamdulillah. Finally. And then when he went there, she left up her skirt and he found that her legs is full of hair. Like what? How this happened? Because Jeannie brother, they made her look like she have hair so Suleiman will not have boom boom with her. If, 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 true story. So be careful. Maybe the women, she don't have hair, but Jeannie, Shaitan, he can make her full of hair for the purpose of a propaganda of his evil. You go to the bedroom, your wife, she take off her clothes, you find a monkey. What happened? Satan, brother, he made her full of hair. You say to her, like, what I did marry, a woman or a chimpanzee? She might even, and by the way, don't talk about chimpanzee, that will take us for another hour. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't want to go there. 15 minutes, huh? True story. <clears throat> I mean, it's 15 minutes. I'm supposed to, I'm done now too. Uh, you remember the story of the monkey who she committed adultery, don't you? My friend, never marry a monkey. Obviously, they can leave you for the sake of a banana. Never date a monkey, marry a monkey, and put your money in the bank of monkeys. Because if you do that, look what happened to this Mr. Chapanzi. He slept, even he, I mean, guys, he was sleeping over her arm. Still, she was able to cheat with different monkey. No, I'm not making fun of Arab women. I'm talking about a fact. We are, we are, you know, Middle Eastern. We are uh, Middle Eastern in general. We are here, you know. Uh, anyway, so uh, brother, during the pre-Islamic uh, of supposedly the Arab before Islam, they were ignorant. Listen carefully. Before Islam, people were ignorant. Islam. After Islam, we became people of the ring of Solomon, flying carpet, monkey committing sex, sex. Arab before Islam, they are ignorant. Okay, so in the pre-Islamic period of ignorance, I saw a she monkey surrounded by a number of monkeys. They were all stoned in it because she had committed illegal sexual intercourse. I too stoned that along with them. If you live in Indonesia and you find some monkeys throwing coconut at a female monkey, Obviously, she had sexual intercourse illegally. And now they are stoned because in the monkey there, they don't have rocks. You know, they have coconut. So they throw co uh, coconut. It's more heavy than rocks. Actually, think about it. Think about it. So if you see in Indonesia, you see a monkey. She is being stoned by coconut. You know, then you know exactly what happened. Actually, me, myself, I have this experience. I got a monkey who did committed sexual intercourse illegally and I asked her to walk in the jungle and she said to me, <laughs> which means like, why? I said, because we want to get the coconut from the trees. Don't worry, we will give you an umbrella. You carry it, coconut hit in, your, in the top of the umbrella, nothing happened to you. So she walked and coconut come from everywhere. I made a fortune from this story. By the end of the day, like we have like 100 tons of coconut because the monkeys go crazy. They cannot accept a female monkey committing adultery. It's against Islam, brother. I mean, you are a monkey and you are committing adultery. You cannot do that. Anyway, I spent like a year after that just to collect the coconut from that monkey. But I would do it again. You know, I paid her, I gave her 10 coconut for walking in the jungle, you know. Anyway, she got paid for what did she do, you know, you know, she's a prostitute. Hello, you know, come on, hello, <laughs> hello, why you don't accept my story? 
And now you will see the Muslims, he was saying, Christian Prince is lying. <laughs> he, he did not put a monkey in the jungle. Supposedly, this is the only lie they saw. The lies of the Quran and Muhammad is not there. <laughs> Christian Prince is lying. Did you see, he said, he, he asked a monkey to go in the jungle. Who could believe that? All right, my 15 minute is up. Thank you guys for being here. May the Lord bless you. Don't forget to download the video because in a few hours from now, I will delete all the videos so we can have a fresh new start with the new videos. Thank you very much. God bless you. And until we see you again in another 15 minute, short 15 minute. Until then, Christ is Lord. Islam made up by a dummy for someone who want to be a dummy. And I am not. As simple as that. Thank you. God bless you. And see you soon. Take care.